is um like social media and like the impact on, oh, on like yeah. on phones and screens and like apps on our like day-to-day life nowadays one thing i mean i think my screen time is ridiculously high yeah I, i'm me personally i have uh recently a higher screen time i'll read mine out um yeah if you oh, get your oh. you get yours i'll get mine uh how do you get oh yeah screen time here we go okay so this week yeah it's one day isn't it uh, take how back. do i how do i um like oh see all activity there we go yeah days and then oh okay. oh shit you can go back at the top you can go back yeah, at the yeah, top. yeah so how much so last week what was your average my last week average nine hours five minutes fuck yeah, I'm, I'm four hours and 20 minutes yeah this is the thing bro because like i've got a lot of online commitments in the sense of like i've got to text georgia i was like i'm always checking amazon to see shit i can scan <laughs> <laughs> okay. 63 hours and 41 minutes in the week shit yeah i've got i've got, I've got 30 that was 25 minutes. So I've double your screen time. Four. That's ridiculous. Fucking hell. And I think I've got a high screen time. Yeah, that's... Like, I'm trying to cut down. That's for last week. Let me go back, because it could just be um, a sort of particularly high week. Yeah, th- uh, the my week before that was five hours. My week before that was three hours 50. Jeez. And the week before that was three hours 45. So what do you do? Because a lot of my spare time... Fucking out Instagram for 14 hours. <laughs> Jesus. Four, wait, 14? I think that's in the week. No. Is, is, is this like, over, like, yeah, the whole week? Yeah, the whole week. Okay. Fucking out an hour on uh, Rocket League. <laughs> Can you get Rocket League on your phone? Yeah, bro. Yeah. I, that's my favourite app game at the moment. Is Rocket ah, League. Right. So I, you, actually play, you actually play games on your phone? This is the one game I play on my phone. Everyone, I, don't, I don't have games on my phone. Yeah, everyone plays like Clash Royale and shit and I just go on this. I'm a beast at it. <laughs> so I spent last... Yeah, last week total, I spent six hours 32 on social networking. Damn. Can definitely cut that down. Um, five hours, six minutes on entertainment and an hour and 37 on health and fitness. That's like the like my fitness app. Oh, yeah. Like the timer app. So 55 minutes on Spotify. Four hours and 10 on YouTube. To be fair, on YouTube, I'm not always looking at my phone. So yes. I like, yeah, I put on a video and then I'll put it down and I'll walk about I with do, my I headphones do, in. I do that, I do that. So my screen time may be a little bit less um snapchat fucking four hours four hours on snapchat yeah damn fucking hell bro an hour and 55 on instagram an hour and 36 on like my fitness app 55 minutes on spotify 45 minutes on safari and 33 minutes on tiktok um guess what you think my instagram is it's my most used app this is the whole week um yeah Five hours. Guess again. Seven hours. Four more. Ten. Fuck off. Twelve. Fifteen. Fourteen. And a half. Fuck. That's it. I I haven't like looked at my screen time. I looked at it. Like, if you think, think about all the shit I could have been doing for fourteen hours. <laughs> yeah, this is a thing. Oh my god. This is the thing with a lot of people today. They'll they they always I always hear like, oh, I don't have time. I don't have time. I don't have time. Make time. Look at your screen time. If your screen time is over like two hours a day, you have time. Yeah. Like, what are you doing? Like, I, I find I find myself, I, as much as I try not to, I find myself just like doom scrolling like i'm just yeah, i'm no, si- i'm sitting there and i'm just scrolling i'm not even thinking i'm just looking i'm just consuming mm-hmm. and as well I'm, I've, I've noticed as well my mood is like directly like correlated to how much time i spend on my phone so the all my all my all screens in general mm-hmm. the more time i spend on the screen the more like down i am in terms of my mood interesting and i, th- I think Anyone who's kind of like, oh no, well, you know, I'm I'm having fun. Like, mm. are you fucked? Well, yeah. See, when it comes to phone screen time, very rarely. Like, mm-hmm. I, it's not like, it's not necessarily like if I'm texting someone, it's not bad, but it's also not fun. It's just like yeah. I'm just texting someone. I think when it comes to screen time, I recently started trying to play Xbox more because it's something I enjoy, right. and so it's like that brings me joy. Right. That that. But apart from that, my screen time on Xbox is probably like an hour for the week. 
like it's not a big i don't play it that much mm -hmm. but yeah no i know what you mean about it's like when you're just there like i'm not interested why, why it's so easy this? to get into that as well like because the, the apps tiktok and instagram and snapchat and youtube they have literally like tested the most efficient way to get as much screen time as possible like they they are specifically designed literally to the to the to the type of font and the size of the font that's how like detailed they've gone into like testing how much you're going to spend on their app and it it's like they i think it was steve jobs he didn't let his daughter have an iphone beast yeah. so he he was like no yeah and, like, and app engineers like they know themselves like yeah this is fucked up like you like and they get pulled into themselves like yeah that must be a weird position to be someone who's like yeah. right how are we gonna rope people in even for like us it's like if we're saying like uh you know get off your screens don't look at your phone and then i'm gonna go and look at instagram for 14 hours okay, a week I mean, and we're making a podcast oh true for, actually for, for people stay to... on your phone right? <laughs> yeah <laughs> watch <YouTube. laughs> i think people need to think of their devices more as a tool not as a consumption because like we've got literally the internet we've, we can do we can find anything we want to find you've never been able to do this in history and that's made us Completion. strangely know nothing we know everything because it's on here but we know nothing like, if, if you ask me like a fact from like like what happened in world war ii or something in london i might i might have learned that but now that i've got my phone i don't need to know it so my brain's gonna lose it because i've got on here i don't need to know it what what dates did um or like the year did world war one start what date did it finish i think i know this is it 1918 for which one World War One, mm -hmm. the start. Start in 1980. No, 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 no. See, this is what I mean. Yeah. See, see, we, we might learn it in school, then we learn it for like an exam. Nah, but now we've got this. Like, yeah. we, we don't need to know it. So our brain doesn't need to like expand and develop. Mm -hmm. That's going to fuck our brains up. I think it's already done that. Um, it's just w it's yeah. way beyond that. Um, I think as well, I think uh, World War One started in 1914. Yeah. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. See, see, yeah. see. It's the phone. It's the phone. <laughs> it's, the, it's not. The phone. My, it's not my <laughs> inferior knowledge. It's the phone, bro. I'll Google it. I remember actually. Um, I got like the best um sort of history or like school report I'd ever had. It was from mm. um. Do you remember Miss Alicia? Yeah, yeah. Um, and she was like. Yannick displays superior knowledge in class. <laughs> and, like, I walked around with a bone of like a week after that, bro. I did yeah, not 1914 play. to 1918. Well, nice. well done. Nice. Well done. See, even with nine hours a day. Fuck, nine hours a day. I can't. Oh. That's fucked me up a little. And one of the other um, negatives is your attention span. It's, it, it's, it, it's so accepted in society. Everyone's like, Facebook, TikTok, Instagram, bam, YouTube, bam, Snapchat. Bam, bam, bam. Like, people don't realize it's not talked about and it's not brought up as often as it should be because it's a serious issue. Because mm -hmm. it could a challenge if people actually want to do this. Sit down, turn, turn your phone off for one hour, and focus on something. One thing. Yeah. One thing. Focus on one thing, and I guarantee you won't be able to do it if you're not used to like turning your phone off. I guarantee you. You won't I, be able to do it. I reckon I struggle with that because I always have um, like background music on. I've always got this on. Like I, I, it like I've conditioned myself for it. Like when I am um, trying to sleep without having like a meditation thing on, I'm like, fucking. That's <sighs> the thing with, with attention is because it's it's such a, it's an instant dopamine hit. Like we yeah. like on tick like on TikTok right, video, video, swipe video. Video, mm -hmm. video, video, video. And that's why I deleted it. Yeah. Because I like I, I sort of deleted it and then replaced it with Instagram Reels. Yeah. Which just just me. Instagram Reels and YouTube Shorts. Not even tic not TikTok anymore, but Instagram Reels and YouTube Shorts will just they'll like I, once I start, it's like no, I I twenty to, minutes have gone by. I have to pull myself yeah. away because I'm like, oh, he's fighting him. Let's look at that top ten knockouts. Let's look at yeah. that. It's like and it's in such a short format. It's like the whole idea of oh, I've got time for this. Mm -hmm. I've got time for this. Oh, it's just one more. Yeah, that's just one more. Yeah, because it's that. Fast. And then it goes. And the thing is, what I, people say like, oh, we not get bored, so I go on TikTok. What? Why? You, yeah. like, like, you're just gonna be bored on your you, phone. You cannot. You you can't. You're that much. Like you can't sit with your own thoughts, or you don't have something else to focus on. 
that you just go on TikTok and you're just getting overstimulated. So your brain, it's not relax, it's not relaxing at all. No. Like you think, oh, I'm just gonna chill my phone, just gonna like you know go on Instagram. It's not relaxing because your brain's constantly being stimulated. It's, it's different with like reading or um, like sometimes when I, when I go to bed, I will literally, oh my, my phone been, has been off for like an hour or two hours because I turn it off early and I'm lying in bed. I will literally I lie in bed and I just look at the wall. I just look at the wall. Yeah. And I think, I just think, I sit there with my thoughts and I just process my thoughts and I just, people don't do that because because this is here now. Whenever you get bored, whenever you start thinking of something, you just go on that, go on that, go on that. People don't sit down. And I think that might be another thing about mental health these days, like what's seriously affecting them. Is people can't sit down and they're not comfortable with the thoughts yeah. that are going through their heads. They haven't like processed, processed them, they haven't, they haven't written them down, they haven't analyzed them. Like what, what's causing them to think this? What issues are there? And I think I I do think that this is like yeah, so this is very is, good point. there's so there's so much that it affects. Mm. Like with, with when I'm like if I do revision, what I do is um, I'll do thirty minutes, phones away. Pure focus. I put a timer on. There's nothing else that I'm doing. I'm focusing on that one thing. And people need to learn. Re, need to, people need to relearn. And I I find this as well. If I when I've spent I've gone through a few days where I'm spending loads of time on my phone. People need to relearn how to sit down and focus on one thing. Yeah. When people, it's kind of like glorified multitasking. Like if you can multitask, it's like, wow, that's so cool. Look at you. You're being very productive. But you're not actually being productive because say I've got five things I'm trying to do at once. I can't actually do five things at once. I can't be like typing on a computer here and then typing on a computer here. I do like five minutes there, five minutes there, five minutes there, five minutes there. And you're not actually being efficient. You're not getting things done. You actually do less. Yeah. If you just like hyper focus on one thing, smash it out, and then do the next thing, it's much more f- efficient. And our brains can't can actually process the one thing when you've got like more things on the go. You just yeah, you o- get overwhelmed. Yeah. And you, it's like the sheer magnitude of all the shit you have to do makes you do nothing. It's like I'll, usually I write a to do list of things I've got to do in a day.